Oops, oops, oops. Sorry, folks. Hey, Anthony Monteith here. How are you? Welcome to my Chi Life Castle in the middle of nowhere <laughs> on the top of a hill. So, yeah, so one's coming over, as you know. It'll be a kind of a, it'll be a weird weekend, I think, because it's like a bank holiday. So I know a lot, I know a lot of people in Ireland are like their bank holidays, but uh, we are definitely restricted in our time with Juan because he's traveling now also to the Philippines. So he's got Mexico, obviously all of Spain, the Canary Islands, uh, I think Poland, Switzerland, various other places that he's traveling to. Uh, so uh, we're going to try and get a venue, uh, depending on numbers. Uh, we've got uh, quite a few new people registered on this journey, which is great. Like people that I have not heard or seen of before, which is great. Please share, please share uh, with others if you think it's valuable enough to, to do. I'm definitely obviously going to be there and Juan has asked me to organize for 23 advanced training from these two groups that we've done from last year, this year. I'm trying to encourage him to come more than once a year. So he said that preliminary he may do uh, December for us as well. Uh, what that will be, I don't know. <laughs> could be advanced. I'll, I'll see if I can twist his arm. But if you could please, um, please share the seminar that's coming up with him in July. That would be great. I'd really appreciate it. Just walking the dog now. What a beautiful day. Uh, Wednesdays are my day off, which generally involves bringing the kids to various events, basketball, ukulele, gymnastics, and walking the dog. Um, I'm hoping that you're enjoying springtime. I know it's, uh, it's fantastic to see everything coming up, all the flowers, all the daffodils. I'm not very good with this camera, am I? So, uh, I also wanted to mention two other brief things briefly, not related to UAT, but um, there will be Jonathan Shubbs coming over again at the end of April. So, I think it's 30th of April, 1st of May, to do UAT3. Now, UAT3 is is a, a deeper and better understanding of uh, the I Ching as, as it is applied to acupuncture for balancing uh, meridians. Um, those of you who would have trained with Tan or maybe even Eileen Han would have done the advanced training, which would have been meridian conversion therapy and all that. This is a good thing to do. The, I've convinced uh, Jonathan to, to take on Everybody and anyone who is interested, who has an, has a background in uh, points and meridians or acupuncture or is an undergraduate studying that sort of system. The reason is we need to grow the knowledge, <clears throat> but also for professional acupuncturists, qualified, licensed, trained out there, or those that have just qualified and need to get a handle on the dynamics. So I've, co I've convinced Jonathan to not not teach like one, you must do one, you must do two, you must do three, that you can jump in and you can do three, two, one, or two, three, one, or any at various combinations of those in order. And it's been working. It's been working because the way he teaches, he always sets the, the foundation in the first morning anyway, so you understand where we're going. Um, so that's coming up. What else do we have? Also, Solheil, Solheil Farzam. If you don't know who he is, check him out. Solheil is um, based in Melbourne, I think, in Australia, and was over last year teaching uh, his eight confluent point system for uh, mental and spiritual health. He is, um, he's gonna be going again. Um, we're hoping in June, 
I'm just trying to tie down the dates with him so because he travels to Europe every summer to to do two things one to teach two to visit family uh, and catch up with everything now in light of recent events I don't know what his schedule will be for other countries like Poland or whatever but I'm going to try and get him into Dublin um, for that dog's barking excuse me so yeah Sol Heil's work is uh, born out of an interest in mental health his own mental health to begin with and then the mental health of others which as we know has become a huge issue in these modern times um, and he also teaches uh, he's very good at marketing and public speaking and if you see his websites they're very slick and very sort of Americanized uh, sales sales slickness but so he's good that's what his his one of his specialities is uh, is sales and marketing and growth so if you need a mentor or somebody to help you grow your acupuncture practice or maybe you're looking to expand your practice and make like multidisciplinary practice or anything like that that's what he's he can help you with and that's a separate lecture and he's asked me he thinks he well he believes just from the facebook groups that he's created there's enough interest in in ireland to to do that so um let's see what comes of that so so a busy year for me this year uh Juan, obviously Jonathan ongoing, Sol Heil's the new new kid on the block, and um, I'm back in West Cork, well, I say back in West Cork, it's been 20 years since I was in West Cork, but I'm in West Cork teaching Twina um, for the next few months, every month, so if you know anyone who has interest in learning the physical therapy of Ireland, of <laughs> the physical therapy of China, 100 million people or more a year every year in the hospital systems of China receive Twina as a physical therapy because it covers the areas of, of massage, osteopathy, chiropractic style work, physiotherapy style work um, with the added benefits of all the Chinese medicine theory as well as modern understanding of the body. So that's why I do it. That's why I practice it. Not for everyone. You need to be physically capable, strong, able grounded rooted but it's uh i love it it's my daily nagong so take care i'm gonna get some fitness done get the pick up the pace a bit see if i can walk the legs off my dog and take care be good